Now, a quick word on the Enforcement Directorate, the adjudicating authority of uh, the Directorate of Enforcement. The ED has now adjudicated a show cause notice issued to Amnesty India International Private Limited and its CEO Akar Patel for contravention of the provisions of the Foreign Exchange Management Act of 1999 and imposed penalty to the tune of 51.7 crore rupees and 10 crore rupees respectively. Amnesty India now receives a show cause notice for FEMA violations. In fact, the ED now cracking down a penalty of 51.7 crores to Amnesty India has been slapped. This is a big setback. 10 crore penalty on the former CEO, Akar Patel. In fact, the Enforcement Directorate now, as it cracks the whip, issues a show cause notice to Amnesty International. Uh, of India Private Limited and its CEO Akar Patel for contravention of provisions of the Foreign Exchange Management Act 1999, FEMA violations. As for that, a penalty now been imposed on the CEO Akar Patel of 10 crore rupees and on the company of 51.7 crore rupees. Huge money, a big setback to Amnesty India. In fact, this is the adjudicating authority of the Enforcement Director. Uh, as they've now issued a show cause notice to Amnesty India. The ED heat on as it uh, now comes down to investigating on FEMA violations. They found uh, some grave irregularities from Amnesty India Private Limited and now the adjudicating authority of the Enforcement Directorate issuing a show cause notice to Amnesty India International Private Limited and its CEO, Akar Patel, for contravention of provisions of the Foreign Exchange Management Act, FEMA violations of 1999. As for this, now a penalty, a hefty penalty has been imposed on the CEO, Akar Patel, of 10 crore rupees and on the company, 51.7 crore rupees. Munish Pandey tracking those developments. Munish, a quick word on Amnesty's irregularities which the ED has now highlighted, slapping a huge hefty penalty on the CEO as well as the company. What were those irregularities that now have put them in the dock? Nabila, we have been given to understand by the enforcement directed is that between 2013 to 2017, there was remittance of uh, around 51.72 crore between uh, Amnesty International UK and Amnesty India International, a company registered in India. Now, what uh, the enforcement directed is claiming at this point of time is that uh, uh, there was violation of uh, Foreign Exchange Management Act and after the reply was uh, filed by Amnesty India International, the adjudicating authority of uh, the enforcement. Right, Manish, thank you very much for joining us with those details. This is the heat of the enforcement director. Now an Amnesty India hefty penalty slapped on the CEO as well as the company.